Let us explore how to add and subtract integers when we have more than two. Question here is, write as an addition expression and then add integers. In this video, we will use counters to add the integers. The first step, however, is to write the expression with addition, right? So you can pause the video, copy these questions and solve them. Since you know the technique, right? You've done a couple of videos similar to this. The only difference is that we have three integers this time, but the method is same. Let's follow the method. A is plus four minus minus two minus plus seven. Let us write this expression with positive signs. That means instead of takeaways, we'll make it addition. So for that, we just need to reverse the sign. So let's do it. So we have positive 4. Let's start with positive 4. And then we have negative. I want to reverse this sign. So when I reverse it, inside sign will also change and becomes plus 2. Next, take away becomes positive. Instead of take away plus 7, we'll do add minus 7. Now both are same things. Take away plus 7 is same as add minus 7. Right? Now once you do that, then you can show your counters. Plus 4 means plus 4, 4 positive counters. Great. Plus 2 means plus 2 counters, 2 positive counters. Plus of minus 7 means 7 negative counters. Let's make negative counters. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Now we simply have to add them. When you add positive and negative, what do you get? You get a zero. So these cancel out. In a way, these are all your zeros, correct? Plus and minus give you zero. You're left with just one negative counter. Therefore, this is negative one. Correct? So it's as simple as that. Let's do the next question. Minus three minus of four if nothing is given, that means it is positive. And then we have minus of minus 5. Let me write this as an addition statement. So it becomes minus 3 plus reverse the sign. It becomes minus 4 plus reverse the sign. It becomes plus 5. Now let's make our counters. Negative 3. 1, 2, 3. Negative 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Positive 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Now let's add them. So plus and minus becomes 0. So these are the zeros. You are left with 2 negative. So what is the answer? It is negative 2. That is how you can add and subtract integers. So it doesn't really matter. The number of integers could be two, three, four, or as many, right? You can follow this technique and add them all. Thank you and all the best.